Hey guys, how's it going? So, um, I'm having a serious issue with my AC. You can see why. The temperature, the ambient temperature sensor is always reading odd numbers and I'll get in the car after it's not been running for a while and it'll read the accurate temperature and then about two minutes later it'll start reading this and what bothers me is the fact that let me put this there we go what bothers me is the fact that the AC compressor does not come on when it's below freezing so unfortunately I don't have AC and it sucks because I replaced the sensor with a brand new genuine GM AC Delco sensor three days ago and I'm having the same or similar problem I checked the harness to make sure that you know it wasn't a connection issue between the harness and the sensor and everything seems to be just fine it started happening the last time that I had the motor out and I don't know why it's done this ever since the rebuild and it's been getting progressively worse now I did follow the uh, the wire diagram. I did follow it, and of course it goes right up to the body control module. So uh, I don't know if something has degraded, um, but um, I believe I could be wrong, but I believe that it's five volts when the uh, when the temperature is maxed out I think it's five volts and uh, because I think the resistance maybe goes down as it heats up so I, I could be wrong it could be the opposite but I'm trying to figure out why it's always reading and I'll sit here and I'll watch it because I'll start the car in the morning it'll read the normal temperature and then over the course of about two minutes the temperature will fall and I thought well maybe it's possible that it was uh, you know up against the AC condenser or something that's causing that but that's not the case it is in its normal stock spot so I'm not really sure what's going on maybe some of you out there would um, be able to uh, you know, answer that for me because right now I don't have AC fortunately it's you know coming up on fall so it's not really that big of a deal but I'm planning on driving this thing next summer or spring and it would be nice to have AC so if anybody out there has uh, any ideas as to why this sensor is not reading correctly, again, uh, a new, brand new sensor. Um, I was told to drive it for a little bit to calibrate it. Um, as soon as I plugged it in, it read just fine, and then over the course of a couple of minutes, it started doing that crap again where it's coming down to 38. So uh, trying to figure that out, it would be nice to and defrost, you know, if the compressor doesn't come on, then I can't defrost my windows. Um, and we've been having some cooler mornings, so there's been a lot of dew on the windows, and it would be nice to be able to actually defrost the windows. But as of now, it doesn't defrost. So if you guys have any ideas as far as that's concerned, let me know, please. Um, this is a strange problem. It's very irritating. I was hoping that if I just unplugged the sensor, then everything would be okay, but that doesn't work at all. Um, because the compressor doesn't come on. So anyways, thanks again for all your support and take care.